No, initial thoughts just is excitement. Um, I was, I've been off, like I said, for a while now, and I'm really looking forward to um, getting going again. And not only that, but with a, an unbelievable team, unbelievable group of boys. So, um, yeah, just looking forward to getting started. Most of the team I know through through playing against them, but um, obviously boys like uh, Bratsy and Kochi, I've I've played with for for quite a long time earlier in our in our careers. Um, and then yeah, I was even I uh, spoke to to Alfie here and there while we were in India. Um, so yeah, you know there's a, there's a lot of boys. Pauli Retre, I did a few of the Ali Roo stuff with. So yeah, I I, I don't think it's going to be too hard to um, to feel comfortable in that change room early on. He's, a, he's just a really, really smart player. Uh, I think I'm going to be looking forward to being on his team. Um, I played against him, you know, against Sydney for the two years prior to that. And he, he's just he's just smart. He's very, with his runs and he's, he's very difficult to, you know, he's always trying to get in behind you or sneak in front of you. And he's always looking to, to score goals in the box. He's, He's a very intelligent player, and yeah, like I said, it's going to be a lot, uh, a lot easier and a lot better when he's when he's on my team. That's for sure. He's, he's just a legend, not of not just only of Sydney, but of the A League. Um, he's had a a full career. He even played in in Korea, which I know, having been over there, is is very difficult. And he he did a long stint there, which um, you can't. You can't put that past anybody because I've been there and it's a, it's a very difficult place to to do well. So, yeah, look, I'm looking forward to playing next to both of them. Obviously, um, Ryan Grant, unbelievable player as well. Uh, Socceroos player, just absolute engine. So, look, I, I'm in a, in a good spot there in between them. Um, and then I can do my own thing and, and hopefully, you know, add add to that. Yeah, I think, I think it's what... Uh, Stevie Corica said to me is that it's just, it's just, it's a winning, it's a winning mentality. And I think, you know, you get a lot of fans that get quite upset when players move around the league quite a bit. And that's never been an intention of mine, but also I, I want to win. I want to win and I want to win as much as possible. I had a very good, you know, youth development with when Ange come through, I wasn't, uh, we did two grand finals and then I man managed to get on in the third one, but, um, they had a, you know, the three years where they they didn't they never lost, which was unbelievable to be there during that period under Ange, and then went down to Muskie, and like you said, you know, with the the Alliance game where it come down to pens and um, Sydney got over us, but yeah, that's that's what I want to be a part of. I want to be a part of the the finals and the big games and the ones that bring excitement and bring fans to the to the stadiums. Yeah, it was a. Uh, like you said, I think I have more kind of um, <laughs> not so much of a fond memory for me being on the other end. But look, it was some some finals I, I watch and I've been a part of and you you can say, oh, the football's not that great. Um, that final was, I remember it was very intense and okay, the, the football was unbelievable but because it was very intense and very fast, but it was exciting and it didn't, it come down to penalties and then... I think just the atmosphere there, the atmosphere, you know, was probably one of the best that I've ever been a part of. Um, and that was the Sydney fans, obviously at Allianz. But yeah, I mean, my memory of it, it isn't great because we we lost. But like I said to you, that's what I want to be a part of. And and when you win that and and being a part of those celebrations and what that means is is where, where I want to be and what I want to do. Oh, absolutely. I think... Um, you know, if you look at Western Sydney's new stadium and all the all the players across the league that have played there and know how how good that is, it's probably the best in the in the league now. So I think Sydney's will probably match that, if not go better. Um, but yeah, like you said, look, uh, anything is possible. And first things first, I need to go and and perform and play well, and I'll, I'll concentrate on that. And then yeah, football football's crazy. Anything can happen overnight, but. Um, there's no reason, you know, if you really enjoy your club and you do well and the team does well, then then why not? It's a, you know, I just want to be somewhere where I'm enjoying it at this point in, in my career.